بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سورة مريم آية نمبر 59 أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم فخلف من بعدهم خلف أضاعوا الصلاة واتبعوا الشهوات واتبعوا الشهوات فسوف يلقون غيا صدق الله العظيم In this ayat al-kareema, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala explains the continuity of the next generation. Allah ta'ala says, فَخَلَفَ مِن بَعْدِهِمْ خَلْفٌ And they, the good people, were followed by evil successors. Those who came after them, the next generation, became corrupted, became evil. Their actions became a means of their destruction. So what did they do? أَضَاءُوا الصَّلَاةَ وَاتَّبَعُوا الشَّهَوَاتِ They literally destroyed their salah and prayer by becoming negligent in the performance of their salah. When these people neglected and destroyed their salah, what followed? وَاتَّبَعُوا الشَّهَوَاتِ They became slaves of their desires. And then ultimately, this led to the total devastation and destruction. So what do we learn from this ayat karima That the sin of immorality, the sin of shamelessness, has the potential to destroy an entire society. But the gem and the pearl that we extract from this ayat is that in the establishment of salah, in the lives of people, this will ensure the prosperity and the prosperity of every society and every community.